Today we're at the Freeman Story Museum right in the heart of Vienna, Virginia, right off the W-O-N-D. And I'd like to invite you in and uh, take a look at what we've got. It's wonderful and it's a great place, little store to shop. Isn't this so enchanting? Susan. Hi. Welcome. Well, thank you very much, Susan, for having us. Oh, my pleasure. Thanks Can you for uh, stopping by? Great. Tell us a little bit about the, the place. Well, uh, the building's been here since 1859, uh, never been moved. Uh, Mr. Lidecker built it to um, raise his family here, and he had a general store. The Civil War broke out, and it became a hospital for wounded soldiers. And he, he took, um, he had a a store here as well, dry goods, a grocery store. He and a train came through the WNOD trail and he was able to get his goods that way. And now it operates as a museum and a store and a gift shop and a used book sale. We have um, local books, local history books. We have unique gifts. A lot of them are made here in Virginia, some even more local, some made in Vienna. Uh, we have towels, we have blankets, we have jams. We have candy from Virginia. We have a lot of exclusive items. Um, we take pride in having those exclusive items that we can offer to visitors when they stop in. Cards, um, mugs, uh, Christmas ornaments uh, made of historic buildings here in Vienna. Wow, that's wonderful. Tell me a little bit about upstairs. Upstairs we have two rooms. One is the parlor with antique, beautiful antique furniture from the 1800s, and that's where we hold afternoon teas. We have teas at Christmas time, and we have uh, teas throughout the year. We had a mother-daughter tea. We had the language of flowers tea. Uh, we've had women's suffrage movement teas. And if you would like to schedule a specialty, we are happy to do that. We can accommodate up to 22 upstairs. And all of the sweet treats and sandwiches are made in-house um, by the wonderful, talented ladies on the Board of Historic Vienna. That's wonderful. Do you have other activities throughout the year? We do. We have uh, Santa comes twice in the month of December. We have um, the Easter egg roll hunt outside in, uh, in springtime. We are open during Oktoberfest, Viva Vienna. We have, oh gosh, a few others that are just um, not on the tip of my tongue right now. But we coordinate a lot of events with the town of Vienna, and we like to be open for all of the uh, afternoon, the chilling on churches that they have during the summer months, Friday evenings, once a month, June, July, August, September. Building well, wonderful. Life. Well, I'm going to walk around for just a few oh, minutes do. and let people yes. see what the store is all about. Terrific. Thanks, Susan. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Alrighty. See you soon. Okay. <laughs> Lots of books fun games that children used to play with. Virginia and Mike, would you like to have something to say? Sure. One of the things we really like here is the 19 ornaments, which you can see to your right. If you go over to here, you'll see all the ornaments. There are 19 ornaments in the series. And there's also one just for Madison High School. It's not really an ornament, but it's uh, another style that sits on your shelf and this one is special it was uh, designed by a, a student who's now graduated from Maris, Madison named Mimi Sang and it has the history of the school on the back. Oh wonderful. Well thanks Mike I really appreciate it what a great story you have. Oh, thanks. <laughs> right let me go walk upstairs and have them take a look. History all along the wall. Yes, women's suffrage is going yep. to last until 2020. Oh, fun. All we about the women's suffrage. Years. Yeah. And then this is where the teas are held. And Santa comes. There you go, that's the Freeman 
store and museum, please feel free to stop by and uh, take a look. Bye.